everybody welcome to my channel I'm here to share with you guys my Target haul now I haven't done a Target haul in a while because I just kind of was getting burnt out on going to store to store to store to store so I ended up going to Target today because you guys know what I want to hit my merry and bright bonus I'm currently at 46 rebates I need was it 96 more left to go 96 more left to go so I'm pretty excited so I'm gonna share with you guys what I got um, before I before I went in the store I totally forgot that they have a weekly bonus and the weekly bonus was called the midweek mistletoe and I needed 10 rebates for five dollars didn't even know that um, but I did hit that because I also went to Walgreens right after this because I wanted to get the Pepsi deal. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, I did the Pepsi deal yesterday at my Walgreens video and it's a pretty great deal. Um, I'm going to stock up on as many times as I can. The deal does end in a couple days so if it rese resets again this week, I'm going to go back to Walgreens and do the deal again because it is a great deal. So I did get the $5 weekly bonus because I had 10 rebates. This one for today I did one, two, three, four, five, six. I did six rebates or eight. I don't know. Between the 10, I did something. But I'm going to share with you guys what I got. Okay, so the first deal I did was the Quaker uh, Kids. Now, I actually had a Peely coupon that I got at the grocery store the other day, and I'm like, I'm just going to see if I can use it on something. And I did. Now, these were originally $2.59, and there is 20% off Target Circle. So, I used that. But, and then I also used a $1.25 off of two uh, coupon. But it, these are coming up as $2.31. So, I don't know... <sighs> how it came up to be 231 when it's supposed to be under that but my receipt said 231 for each one so i don't that is not 20 percent off and that is not the dollar 25 off a of two coupon i don't know what went wrong but if you guys would pay four dollars and 62 cents if you have that coupon but you get a dollar 50 back with ibotta and a dollar 50 back with ibotta making these a dollar 62 or just 81 cents each so I did get those, but I don't know how, sometimes their target circle, the percentage thing confuses me. So yeah, then I did the Tabasco sauce. Now my husband just left to go to work, so he obviously has to help himself and grab stuff before I even do my video. So I ended up getting two of these tobacco, Tabasco sauce, and then I got one of the Chipotle, and then I got one of the uh, green chili sauce. So these are on sale this week for $3.19. Okay, so you can do this deal twice in a transaction. So if you buy two of them, it comes to be $6.38. If you buy four of them, it comes to $12.76. But with Checo, 50, Checo 51 and Swag Bucks, you guys can get a bonus. Now please remember, Checo 51 and Swag Bucks are sister apps. So you do have to use one uh, email for one and another email for the other for them to really work. Um, but anyways, you get 75 cents per each one for Checo 51. So you get $1.50 back and $1.50 back for every two that you get. Then with Swag Bucks, you get 500 uh, points for buying two of them. So that's $5. So if you buy two of them, you'll pay $6.38. You get $1.50 back with uh, Checo 51 and you'll get 500 uh, points, which is $5 back with Swag Bucks, making it a 12 cent moneymaker. If you buy four of them, you'll pay $12.76. You'll get a dollar fifty and a dollar fifty. That's three dollars back with Checo Fifty One. Then you get ten dollars back with Swag Bucks. These come out to be a twenty-four cent money maker. So there was a time, uh, God, a couple months ago, I maybe a year or so ago, I ended up going crazy over Tabasco sauce. We had so much it was crazy. So the next thing I got is the Siete Taco seasoning. This is mild, and then I got the tortilla chips. My daughter has already helped herself to the chips. So the seasoning was $2.99 and the chips were $4.99. Um, to, if you buy them together, they're $7.98. But with Ibotta, you get $1.50 back with uh, the chips and then you get $0.75 cents back with the seasoning. Then with uh, Shop Kicks, you get 140 kicks for purchasing and scanning the product, which is $0.56 cents back for each one. Then, um, then if you buy a 
both of these together with shop cakes you get a 600 point bonus which is actually two dollars and 41 cent 40 cents is a bonus and then for there was also a bonus so if you buy two of these with ibotta so i got a 75 cent bonus so all together i got a dollar 50 75 cents 56 cents 56 cents 75 cents and two dollars and 40 cents these come out to be $1.46 or so just 73 cents each, which I was a pretty excited to see that. I totally was not, I totally didn't even know that there was a bonus for the um, Shopkick deal until I was like submitting my receipt. I'm like, oh, or when I scanned the items in the store, I'm like, oh yeah, that's sweet. So I got that. Now this is something that made me mad. In my Target circle, I had a coupon that says buy two, get one free. It showed it right there. I looked at my receipt after I paid for it and that coupon did not come off. I don't know what I can do. I don't, I, I feel weird returning food, but these were 99 cents. Uh, I was supposed to get the buy two, get one free coupon come off, but it didn't work. But together you would pay $2.97 for three of them. You get a 20 cent rebate with Ibotta. You also get fetch reward points. So these come out to be just $2.39 or 79 cents each. So I did buy three of them. If I knew that coupon was good, not going to work, I would have just bought one of them because I don't need that much Cheetos um, macaroni and cheese. So I'm just going to put some of this back in the bag because I don't need all this stuff. I've been filming at my desk lately because the lighting's just been a little bit better than my ring light. So, yeah. So the next deal I did was the Honey Stinger. My actually my husband really likes this and he likes the salted caramel. So these were $1.39 and they are 20% off with Target Circle. For three of them you would buy two, or you'd pay $2.85. But with Ibotta there's a $1.50 off a of three uh, rebate. Comes out to be just $1.35 or 45 cents each for three of these, which is a great deal. Husband already took two of them to work with him already. So yeah. And then I got two more deals to share with you guys. So I did the Tezo tea art, if I'm saying that right, Tazo Tezo. These were $3.79. There is a 20% off Target Circle deal, making these $3.03. I totally forgot what the rebate was. I didn't write that down. I have it all set out, but I totally forgot to write it down. So my rebate for the Tezo was, oh, how did I not do the math for this? Um, $1.50. So you get $1.50 back with this. So this just comes out to be $1.53. $1.53 for that, which is an okay deal. And it expired a couple days ago. That's nice. That's 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 really nice. It expired a couple days ago. Didn't even bother checking the date on that. Then the next thing I got is the Beyond Burger. My in, my in-laws actually like this, so I'm probably just gonna give it to them. So these are on sale this week for four dollars and twenty-nine cents. I did use a printable dollar off coupon from the Beyond Burger website. I just Googled it. The coupon did not work, so she actually had to uh, just took off a dollar. So paid three dollars and twenty-nine cents for this. But you get $3.50 back with Ibotta, which I was actually pretty excited for. Then I didn't realize this until I was submitting my receipts, but there was a Fetch Rewards deal for 3,500 points for purchasing this. So for Fetch Rewards, I actually got $3.50 back with that. So this, this alone came to be a $3.71 moneymaker. Yes, I don't know. I kind of want to try this, but then a lot of the people are saying that they get sick from it, so. I don't know, but that was my haul. I was really trying to find the omelet rounds because nobody in my area sells them. The Justin Bar, my store said they had them in stock. I could not find them. And then that was it on my list. Um, my total came to $37.50. With, with Ibotta, I received $12.35. With Checkout 51, I received $3.00. With Shopkick, I received 880 points, which is $3.52. With Swagbucks, I received $10. With Fetch Rewards, I received 3,711 points, which is $3.71. Totally did not realize I hit the miss midweek mistletoe, so I received $5 for that. And then the I received the, um, the Snowflake bonus, which I think was like, 30, how many rebates did I need to get that? Um, between Target 
and the, where is that snowflake? I needed 37 rebates and I got that between my last Ibotta hauls I've been doing. So I got $10 back with that. And then the Siete, I got a 75 cent bonus. So without the snowflake bonus in it, um, I everything came to be an 83 cent moneymaker. But since I received that $10 bonus, everything came to be a $10 and 83 cent moneymaker. I am so excited with what I got. I'm really gonna push that. 140 rebates you guys so you'll definitely try to see me do more I bought a rebates but give this video a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already it's absolutely free and I'm here to share with you guys deals on how to save money that's my daughter but how to save money not just couponing but otherwise a ton of other things but again thanks for watching see you guys next time Bye.